Uh, today I'm flying with Alec, and uh, we're gonna do a few things. But really, what I'm gonna what I'm gonna put up as a video is uh, for takeoffs and landings. I had a uh, a viewer write in and asked if we could demonstrate that uh, in this plane. I volunteered Alec to show us how to do it. Uh, he has not flown since December. It's now uh, almost April, almost April 1st. It's uh, So he's had a few months off, so we're going to throw him right into the fire. We can nail some short field landing. On a nice windy day. It is a little windy. It is 11, gusting 17, about 40 degrees off the runway. So we wouldn't want it to be too easy for him. All right, that'd be crazy. Time to start five, six, 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 Two zero, clear for takeoff on course, five two six, Delta Sierra. All right, yeah, you can still stop a minute and get all your stuff done. All right, landing lights are on, strobes are on, flaps take off, fuel pump on, propeller full, mixture full. And that's good, and switch over to tower. All right. All right, you rolled out the red carpet for us. It's coming from the right. From the right at about 40 degrees off the runway, so it might might need a little bit of a... We're doing short direction. field takeoff too. If you want to do a short field takeoff here, that's cool. All right, come to a stop. It's all good. Right, full power. Keep her centered. Okay. Alright, sir. 449 X-ray. We're about to push to the east uh, with Alpha. Whoa, 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 whoa. Yeah. Squirrely. Alright, so keep her going. Uh, VX, VY. I can't remember which one this plane doesn't have. I'm not sure what happened there. Keep her climbing to 67 until you clear your obstacle. Runway 20, clear limb. All right, now you're clear of your obstacle. Really, short field takeoff, there's nothing, runway 20, clear to land. nothing too complicated about it. And the brakes, let the engine develop full power. Release the brakes, you got to watch. You may want to pull to the left pretty hard because you're full power. Rotate at normal speed, uh, but then we're going to keep her at VX uh, until we clear our imaginary 50-foot obstacle. So, and then we can come bring her back down to a little uh, higher speed. Yeah, this might be a <laughs> challenging day for a short field landing. Now, today being bumpy and windy, we may not land any of them. We'll see how it goes. There you go. Wind two three zero five gusting 15. That's what. That's 50 degrees off the runway heading. So 10 knot gust factor, immediately you got to put, or 10 knot gust, you got to put a 5 knot gust factor in there. Probably a day, if you really had to go land at a short field, you might not want to do it. Or you would just, you know, practice more than one landing every three months. Well, that too. Alright, landing like stroke. First notch, fuel pump, full prop, a little more mixture. Anson County traffic, Diamond 526, Delta Sierra, turning final, runway 16, Anson. Yeah, it's windy. Uh, it is windy and bumpy. Like, look at this crab ankle. That's for traffic, Skyhawk 9801 Golf, 12 miles north of the field, VFR straight at runway 2. Power. Okay. All right, let's do full stop. We ate up too much runway. I thought she was going to hit harder than she did. That's why I said feather power, but she didn't really hit that bad. She a balloon just a little bit on you. All right, in these conditions and not having landed in four months, that wasn't too bad. That is not 40 degrees off the runway. That's 90 degrees off the runway. Yeah, it's directly. <laughs> it's across. Well, you saw the angle I was... Pull in whenever we turn fine. Yeah, but you did manage to get her on center line. Okay. Got a little crosswind correction. I like it.
Ah, as soon as you get above those trees, there it is. Bada boom, bada bing. I don't know if you did that intentionally or not, but you were a little bit right of center line, but I was actually fine with that because the wind was coming from the right, so that gave you more runway to work with should it, should it shove you over. Yeah, it wasn't really intentional. Okay, yeah. I kind of... Wasn't being pulled. Uh, you, you kept it pretty straight. You were right of center line, but it wasn't like continually going right. And that's kind of my method. Once you start picking up speed, if you're straight and you're safely on the runway, if you're a little off the center line, sometimes it's better just to ride her straight instead of trying to get her back. Anson County traffic, Diamond 526, Delta Sierra, left crosswind, runway 16, Anson. Oh, this may turn from a short field landing video into a crosswind landing video. So you used a crab. I don't know if you're comfortable with a side slip or not. Are you just a crab guy? Yeah, I don't know. It's been a while since I've done either. A side slip. Okay, good speed, 75 with this kind of wind. That's a good speed. Okay, using your crab to keep her lined up. Okay, now I've picked up a bunch of speed. Right, you got time to bleed it. Oh, little wind shear. Did you see that speed drop? Yeah, down to 67. Yeah. Okay. A soft touchdown might have been just a skosh pointed left, but in this wind, I'll take it. All right, I'm going to put your flaps up for you. We'll do a full stop. Edge carry traffic, down 526. Don't see your five mile final practice, RNAV 16. 25 knot crosswind. I agree. All right, there's minimums. Yeah, I'm glass is on. Okay. get her to sit down. Yep. Okay. Wasn't a picture perfect landing. Out, Tommy. All right, that was a workout. Yeah. I might keep her a little bit on the right side myself. Oh, she don't want to go up. Did not want to go up. I don't think you were fast enough. I saw like right at 50. Oh, was it? I thought it was 58, 59. Right there, I thought I didn't put the flaps in. Oh, Nelly. Hey, so same 10 knot gust, so we'll throw an extra five. So I would probably shoot for about 75 on final. All right, so we didn't get any short field landings. Uh, nope. But we did get some nice crosswind landings. Every landing. I think that's the new video. Crosswind landings. That was 12 gusting 20 something out there. Yeah. And so hopefully they're right here, 40 degrees off, 12 gusting 20 or 21 or something like that, but 
That's not a direct crossway. Of course, that's what Anson said too, didn't it? Said it was like 40 degrees off the runway. They lied. Okay, I'm sorry, 6 Delta Sierra, runway 20, clear to land. Runway 20, clear to land, 526 Delta Sierra. <laughs> I'd say you know they're not busy when they clear your land before you even get to the battery. Uh, okay, just keep the nose up. There you go.